What's up guys? We're back out here squidding again. You guys didn't really like the last one, but you know, we're gonna give her another try. Maybe you'll like this one. Um, we're going to be squidding and then cooking. No cleaning because YouTube doesn't like that anymore. But stick around. Oh yeah. <laughs> Better get out here. <laughs> no, put it in the bucket. Put some water in there too. Oh yeah, double. It's fine. Bananas. I think I got mine back. Well. Lied. That's unfortunate. Me and Max just both hung up, and uh, we're down. We're down five squid jigs. <laughs> so we got three squid, and have lost five five squid, five squid jigs so far. Yep. So we're doing pretty well. When you're out here fishing by boat, it's good to be in like 60 to 80 feet. That's where we found most of our success this year. What? I got them all. I think so. <laughs> Get them all, right? Yeah, we're we're about we're about limited three man. Right, there's one. Oh yeah. All right, guys, that's going to sum up the fishing section, but be sure to stay around for the cooking section because that's where it's going to get serious. We're going to get the squid, and we're going to put them in our bag, and then we're going to bread them up with flour, salt, and pepper. And we're going to shake it around, and then we're going to put some oil in, and put the squid in and fry them up. So you're ready. Yeah. You going? Yeah. All right, so now we got our squid in the bag, and we're gonna put the flour into the bag. Maybe. Let me get some close up of this. Okay, go. Enough. Yeah, that's enough. And some salt. Garlic. <laughs> we like to go heavy on the garlic salt. Yeah, apparently. Shooting up the street. North Korea here. Oh, I forgot to sprinkle the salt. I can do it with pepper. Okay, should be enough. Alright. <laughs> Back to the face. You gotta hold it up a little higher. Yeah. All right, so now we got our flour, salt, pepper, squid in the bag. We're gonna give it a shake. <sighs> Once it looks like it's all evenly breaded, I'm gonna go in. Oh shit! We need oil first. Got some geese flying over. I'm gonna take the oil, olive oil, virgin olive oil. Yeah. Never been touched before. All right, we're gonna put. A little bit in the pan. Oh shit! <laughs> what did I tell you was gonna happen? All right, we're gonna turn the flames off. <laughs> so it's not quite as hot. Did you get that on video at least? Yeah. <laughs> what did you think was gonna happen? Not that. Dude, it like caught on fire. <laughs> okay, I think we're ready to go right there. All right, we're gonna cook it on the ground since she's a little hot. <laughs> All right, lay them in. Okay. They're gonna burn in. No, this is good. This is how we want them. <laughs> One. Oh, did, you, did you get anything to flip it? No. Ow. Oh, I got the flip. I got the flip. I got that knocked out. Three. It's all we can fit in our pan. And might as well throw the tentacles in there. Splat. 
Alright, it smells like toast out here. Alright, so we're gonna... Maybe pour some more oil on You don't want to get all the butter off, or the flour off. Back to the fish. Back to my fish. All right, so we got our squid in there. It was a little hot, so we had to take it off the grill. And now I'm just gonna let them go a little bit on each side. They don't take long, and then we're gonna flip them so they don't get tough. I would recommend cooking for like two minutes. You don't want to burn squid. Just probably split the knife. Yeah, probably split. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. With oh, your hands. I have a knife. I can use that. I'm not reaching my hand in there, dude. Just caught on fire. Oh yeah, look at that. That's some grub. Just, just turn it on for half a second. There. Can you get out of it? I'm gonna get some sizzling shot. All right, Nate's first time trying squid. We'll see what he thinks. Not my first time trying squid. Anyways, all right. Calamari, that is. <laughs> I can't bite through it. <laughs> Pretty solid. It's like hard to bite through at first, but then once you get into it, it's like a shrimp. It's not that bad. Maybe a little overcooked too. Yeah. Might have to be a little fire accident. Yeah, not bad. I'd say four out of five stars. Okay. Alright. After I finished chewing it, it has very good flavor. I'd say similar to shrimp, maybe. I would definitely eat it again, but I think we need to learn how to cook it a little bit better. I don't know. We probably overcooked it or something, so drop some comments down below. What we did wrong, how you cook your squid, and we'll be reading and replying to all of those. We're gonna try a squid pasta in the next video. Oh yeah. Hey guys, be sure to like and subscribe for more uh, catch and cook videos. We're gonna get a lot better at these because we're gonna be making them a lot more often over winter break. So definitely drop a like and be sure to subscribe.